after this fight. A room that is now littered with bodies. <laughs> there is just bodies and gore everywhere. The bodies hit the floor. Sure. Um, there are just bodies and gore everywhere. Uh, we need to try to wake up Melvin. Look at you, Kara. Can you wake up Melvin? Healer? I don't have that. Okay. You don't heal have him. something that can heal? Heal him quickly. Oh, heal him. That's I how he was dead. Up. No, he's not dead. Oh. Okay, that's what I meant. I was going to make a medicine, but yeah, no, he's not dead. So let's tie him up first. Okay. He's still yeah. Oh, Where is my skin? Hold on. I want to look for my ball. <laughs> okay. I'll, I'll say I'll give it yeah. to you. Okay. I find my ball. I'm going to try again. I wanna re- I'm want i going to yell, struggle, and I'm going to throw it at Melvin. He, it, 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 okay, roll with advantage. <laughs> Oh my god, not 20. Okay. He automatically fails the save, and then it's just, as as uh, Lilith, the ball leaves from her, her hand, you just see it expands into these bands and just yeah. wraps Melvin's unconscious body. Yeah. Alright, now wake him up. Okay. Uh-huh. Do a quick cure Hailing word. Sure. Also, oh, she can she can just drop one point and wake him up as well. Eleanor you could do, do it that way. Eleanor could just go one point of your lay on hands. Oh, oh you can, can do it save. Too. Oh, she just can save him. You could do that and just okay. put one point in him. Okay, I'll do that. Okay. I'll, yeah, I'll lay of hands. I'll just just <laughs> one point. Eleanor just puts one finger on his nose. Yeah, yeah, yeah and no, boots yeah. his nose for one hit point, and he wakes up in the iron bands of Bolaro. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> What, what the fuck is going on? Yeah. Meanwhile, while they're doing this, I'm taking my sword and I'm pointing it directly at Samwell. Who has his sword pointed at Lorelei. Oh. Why are you pointing that at me? Because you're not my fucking wife, so who are you? Okay, first of all, how Keep that you... pointed at me if it makes you feel better, kid, but it ain't gonna make a bit of difference. What gave it away? That is not her rapier. Okay. So she's your wife, huh? <laughs> yes, she is. She's so pretty. I know. And she does, uh, Lorelai's so gonna do the craft good. thing and, like, turn back into herself. <laughs> huh. Warlock. Interesting. I'm glad to know that you're not on the side of them. Oh, fuck no. Why were you here? Promise to keep a secret? Yes. I was on my honeymoon and I caught whiff of something nefarious. Couldn't resist. You're on your honeymoon and you came to a prostitution ring? To take it down and destroy it, yes. Aren't there better things you could be doing on your honeymoon, like your wife? Well, she's out spending my money. I like her. I like her a lot. Yeah. Anyway, this guy. <laughs> oh, wow. Denise is completely broken. We need to give her a moment here. <laughs> that was really good. I like that. <laughs> who's, who's this one with the sword pointed at me? That's Spot, Spot. He, he seems okay. No, I don't like it. Spot, put the sword down. He's okay. He's a good guy. I'm going to pull back the, the sun blade, but I'm still holding the hilt. <laughs> spot, this is the person. She points to Melvin. This is the person that we should be putting a sword at. This is a person that has a prostitution ring. This is the person that is taking people into slavery. And this is the person, now that you can see who I truly am, who some reason put a hit out on me. Mm. Wait, hold on. Dirty We pen. don't know. Are you slow hands or whatever it smooth is? Hands. Smooth hands. Are you smooth hands? He just stares at you and doesn't answer. Oh, I don't um, make an answer. Intimidation. So anyway, can I try so and ask the same question with intimidation? Sure, make an intimidation check. I am not going to assist because I have a negative one charisma. One? Oh, done a lot of intimidation right there. Oh, I'm um, very intimidating. Eleven? Eleven? Yeah. <sighs> he just stares at you. You can you can try Lilith if you want. No. no. <laughs> she was so proud. <laughs> so proud. And he tripped her away. <laughs> defiantly. Chin up. Lorelai so takes out one of her daggers and she just kind of um, plays with the tip of it. Like, kind of like twirling it and having the, the tip of the dagger just like twirl, you know what I'm talking about? Like on a mm-hmm. finger? Okay. Yeah, like this. Right? Yeah. And I was like, you know what's really funny about me being a vixen is that we learn how to do terrible, terrible things to men. 
Ooh. I would love to practice those skills right now. And she crouches right down and puts the tip of the dagger on his red pants. <laughs> I've been out of practice. You can make an intimidation check. <laughs> and Good. I'll give you advantage on that one. Yay. 16. 16. Mm-hmm. In some circles, I've been known to be called smooth hands. So tell me... Why did I have a hit out on me? Because you've been destroying my network. Your network? Is that what you're calling it? You sell people. You make the money off of what they... They don't make the money. They don't want to be here. Who the fuck do you think you are? One commodity is the same as another. A commodity, she slaps him. (laughs) At this point, I'm going to walk over to the table to the girls... And I'm going to tell them, you can come out now. Mm. And I'm going to start making sure they're okay. Because I think of them as, like, my sisters. Okay. They're tentative, but they come out. Your life, currently, <clears throat> is a commodity. A commodity that I can either choose to keep or sell. Talk. What How big want? is the ring? Where does it begin? Are you the leader of it? Who is the leader of it? I suggest doing a whole lot of talking. Okay, let's go one at a time. What information are you looking to glean? Oh, and I just like rattled it off on the top of my head. <laughs> Rewind. Okay, are you the leader? It's hard to say leader, but he is the, the he's he is the man behind the curtain. He's the money man, yeah. Are there investors? Okay. Yes. I like that idea. Are there other investors? There will there'll always be investors when there's when you have supply, people will demand. Does what the what's the initials? TV? TV, yes. Do you work with TV? Who's TV? Don't make me look it up. <laughs> Ravain Velasmere? Yes, please. Don't make me look it up. Um, not really. <laughs> I try. Not. How big is your network? It spans the continent, but this is the, the hub is really here in Bardman. No, wait. I want to know if he's got any dirt on TV. Do you have any dirt on that guy? Not really. I try to stay off the radar of the royal palace. Mm. You never supply commodities for his parties? Not officially. Okay, unofficially? Have you been to the palace? Yes. Oh, we gotta keep him alive. Do you send women to the palace? Under what circumstances? I have. Never officially for anyone in the royal court. It's been, you know... But they make deal. requests. Backdoor deals. Who are your yeah. contacts? He gives you a few names. Okay. So you work with the elves? Or humans, or anyone who has coin. Just trying to make a buck. Trying to make a buck off of a human life. Selling them into slavery for things they don't want to do. He just kind of shrugs. I look over to the girls. Who's heard that? Who is really upset at that? Who is insanely mad that they were used as a commodity to make a buck, a buck that is not in your pocket. Three of them appear to react like, yeah, I'm fucking pissed off. Like, for three of them, one stays a little more timid, three of them appear to react visibly to that. I, was, I just, I, come to me, come to me now. I have three daggers. Oh. They begin walking towards you. I put a dagger in each hand. I was like, is there anything else you have to say? You commodity, you useless, useless life. Well, what, what's happening here? I'm sure. Come on, come on, come on. We're all we're all reasonable adults here. Like, ladies, repeat after me. Hold on, spot. We might could really use him to get into the palace. There is no way you're going to touch him. I'm going to kill him. Go okay. to the palace and do what? Well, we want to know why the palace wants us dead. It would have been an entryway. It, 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 it possibly could have opened a door to get into it. That's okay. You can make your little self look like him. Okay, go ahead. Yeah, it's all fair. Ladies, repeat after me. The fox is never tricked. The, 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 they, it takes them a minute, but there's the, the fox. The fox never never tricked. And they're not quite in sync, but they say it. And is there a way, like, I don't know if I can be a chance it or whatever, but I have them, like, plunge their daggers into him all at the same time. Like, right sure, you can make a co- coordinated effort. Mm-hmm. Like, on three. Mm-hmm. And on then a... they plunge the daggers into his heart. And uh, they make him a pincushion. One gets a little excited and, like, 
He's like, I would And begin, begin woodpeckering wow. him? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I'm good with this. I'm good with all of this. The doctor's just like, hmm. Well, that's... Oh, 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 I, it, oh you might want to... Uh, oh, whatever, fuck it. <laughs> you said there's stairs in the next room? Yeah. I want to walk over to those stairs while that other stuff is happening and blah, blah, blah. I'm not paying attention. I want to walk down those stairs. Okay. Excuse me. Stealth. Uh, make a stealth check. 13. 13, okay. You go down the stairs, and uh, there appears to be an underground tunnel. Oh, boy. Do I hear or see any living thing or person? Uh, make a perception check. 18 plus 7. You don't hear or see anyone. Uh, the tunnel is lit with sconces in the left wall every 20 feet or so. You can see it goes past your field of vision. I'm assuming they're okay up there. I'm going to be reckless. Spot? No. What are you going to do? I am going to quietly walk out about my my full movement, which is 45. Okay. You go out 45 feet. Uh-huh. Uh, the tunnel is still going. Sniff. Anything? Make, a, make another perception check. 22. 22? Still nothing. Not at this moment. You think you have to probably go a little further. The terrain has not changed. It is just a simple cement, 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 cement with sconces. It is just cement tunnel. Mm -hmm. Can I figure out what direction I'm going? North, south, east, west? Sure. So this would be north, and then you came in going north, so east. Uh, North-ish. North-ish? Okay. Okay, I'm going to quick do a jog back. Okay. So that they don't realize how far I went without them because they're going to get pissed. Okay. Okay. When I come up, I'll share that information. Okay. All right. Um, I am going to say that I'm going to take all of the money that I paid him and I'm going to take it back. Oh, yeah. (laughs) (laughs) Okay. All the gold that anyone kicked in for this, take it back. It was all me. I think it was all her. Okay. We also need to be fully aware that um, there are other people in that bar upstairs. We just killed all these people. Yeah, I think... um, So we can't just, like, uh, We can't just walk upstairs. upstairs. Now, there is a tunnel underneath heading toward the north. I have no idea where it goes, but we can duck out of here. Our faces are seen, and that would be a major issue. And we got to take the girls with us, too. Fine. Uh, before I forget, lay hands give you ten more points. Thank you. And then I'm giving myself ten more points. Twenty-one. Yeah, I also don't feel good. I'm a, a, below half. Do we need like a well, maybe not a short rest down here because no, well, they wouldn't come down here. They, they know that there's a private party. party. It's a private party. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go over to the door and make sure it's locked so we can short rest it. That's okay. what I do. If you short rest, uh, Samwell will aid with a song of rest. Huh. You got it. Instead I'm of singing... I'm going to give him a dirty look the entire time. And he's not going to sing. Mechanically, it's a song of rest. But yeah. eventually, he's going to just tell some stories. <laughs> about some great adventurers he knew. Put you to sleep? Yeah, I'm giving him a dirty fucking look the entire time. Like, who the fuck are you? That's what I'm going to do all the time. Um, I forget. So we get an extra... Uh, with him, you get an extra d10. You can roll your hit dice, but you can roll a d- an extra d10. So, whoever's taking a short rest, mm-hmm. first off, all your spell slots come back, mm-hmm. or lie. Whoever is going to, uh, whoever's down hit points and wants to roll your hit dice for your short rest, we can do that. D10? For you, it's a, uh, for you, it's a d10, yes. For the Eleanor and Morpheus, it's a d10. Yeah. For Spot, Lorelai, and Kara, it's a d8. For Lilith, it's a d6. Hey! Oh, you're fine then. Okay, cool. Oh. I have no solutions to this problem, but I would just like to mention we got a serious problem upstairs. We don't know how many other people are upstairs. We don't know how many people are in the bar and how many people saw us come in here. But granted, I agree. I do want to kind of look around down here, though, to see if there's record books or Absolutely. And I think it would also be really beneficial to loot, hopefully, the whole building. Record books and stuff like that. So if we need to impersonate this guy, we can. Okay. Uh, Whoever's looking around, make an investigation check. I suck at that. Yeah, don't you have 
things? Glasses. He gets advantage on things up close. Oh, okay. It'll be a straight roll for him. Oh. Searching like a room. He gets advantage on things like what's this book for? Or That's a straight roll. how does this lock work? Well, the glasses but I got. Still, but you still get a plus, right? The intelligence. <gasps> yeah, 20. Um, plus 7. Uh, <laughs> I only got 10. Okay, not 20 plus? Oh, I don't have a plus. Okay, natural 20. 10. Okay. Is this for investigation? Yes. I'm oh, sorry. Okay. 15. Okay. First hit dice, how many did everyone use? I know you only used two. I used two plus... Plus the d10 from Sam Wall. Okay. Right. Only used one. All right. I used three. Okay. Did you roll your d10 as well? I were in the extra d10. Okay. Right, so. Spot? Two. Okay. I'm still low, though. I don't, so, I don't, low, I don't want to roll anymore. Lorelei, uh, Morpheus, you're just... Um, you don't find anything too intriguing. Uh, you find that room full of food and, you know, the... You do find a ledger. Okay. Okay, good. That mentions an abandoned manor. An abandoned manor house that is being used for quote-unquote storage. Interesting. Oh, I like that. Yeah. There is transactions that you're getting, uh, like you're seeing pickup dates, like new shipments arrived, things like that. Doesn't say like any contact names or where they're coming from or anything like that. No, no, no. You do. Uh, it doesn't. Well, you see city names. You see like mm-hmm. different city names, like three Denad, mm-hmm. four from like these old different mm-hmm. cities around the, uh, the the continent. As far as the manor house is concerned, is there any details as to location or name or where it might be? You rolled a natural twenty, right? I did. Yeah. Okay, you're thinking that's where the tunnel goes. Oh, ooh, interesting. What's that guy's name again? Um, Melvin. Oh, Melvin. 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 Also known as Smooth Hands. Melvin the Smooth Hands. I feel so much better now that you know who it is. Okay, I'll wait on me. I'm going to show the book to everyone and just... Okay. ...noodles with that information. I mean, I, I think at this point, I don't think anybody really would have taken notice of us coming down here. You know what I mean? Okay. But if we come back up... Mm. Without Melvin, Without covered in gore, you know what I mean? Yeah. Like, this is a bad idea to go okay. upstairs. But but wasn't there a guy at the door? Hmm? Wasn't there a guy at the door who we mm-hmm. paid, mm-hmm. and then he opened the door and let us walk through? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Door. They know us. So you think it's better to leave and let them discover the bodies eventually? No. I think it's good to go upstairs and be like, hey, you, you have all my money. <laughs> 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 and burn the fucking place down. <laughs> yeah, okay. You want to take out the building? She's very angry. Well, Obviously, yeah, that's a effed up building. I Obviously. mean, I would be, I, I'm, but we need to make an escape. Well, yeah. Without the entire armed guards of the the whole city after us. Oh, we're walking around with the Goliath. <sighs> and even if you disguise yourself yeah, as know, Melvin. I'm dancing machine here. Those <laughs> guards are going to want to know where you are. Okay. Well, because they I, did look at you and were very they flirtatious. Desecrate this place a little bit. All right, I have an idea. Take some blood That's and draw a fox. That's what I was going to do. Yeah. yeah. I'm taking Melvin's blood and I'm drawing, drawing the symbol of Dianera. Di- Dianera. Okay. Dianera. Dianera. <laughs> okay. There's On plenty the of blood to go around now. I'm doing it. They turned him into a fucking pincushion. So. And I'm having a fucking great time doing it, like laughing maniacally. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Laura uh, Laura Laura Lai is drawing a fox head on the wall in blood and laughing maniacally. I'm gonna, I'm gonna use, use gone. my crested vegetation <laughs> and just put um, uh, closed down. You know, <laughs> closed for renovation. <laughs> closed. I don't know. Closed, closed for repairs. I was sure. <laughs> okay. Now what? I'm really afraid of leaving a trail. We're going to have problems. we problems either way. we got to just weigh the risk of each okay. escape. Let's so we've here. rested. We've been here four hours. This is this is getting to the point where people are going to come down here. Okay. So here's my problem. This guy flat out said he has connections at the castle, right? Mm-hmm. So now the castle knows who we are to put a hit ass out on us, right? So now... They're going to go to the castle and say, hey, those fuckers that you wanted dead, they're here. And they destroyed this whole thing. That's a problem. Okay, so you're still trying to decide what your next move is. My thought is this. If they have connections at the capital 
and these people know who they are. We can impersonate them fine, okay, whatever. But right now, there's a guard upstairs who just took our money, saw your, well, your fake face, but saw the rest of us Ooh. and can identify us, right? So now we're going to just leave him up there and he's going to come down eventually, find a bunch of dead bodies, not our dead bodies, and he can go to the Capitol and be like, oh, hey, you know those people who you had marked for death? They're in your city. And then the whole city will turn on us and we will be running for our lives. Lorelai turns to the doctor. You might not ha- want to have your wife go anywhere near this district right now. Yeah. Yes, I'm seeing that. It might be time for us to uh, bail out of here and head home. <laughs> Oops. I mean, it's not the first time our lives have been in danger, but... <laughs> <clears throat> you haven't been adventuring very long, have you? Where are you from again? We're from a continent called Balkania, over in the northeast realms. Hmm. No. Home city is called Whitebridge. Oh. Wasn't what's her name going over White Bridge? Oh, yeah. We had a friend who 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 saw a a bridge of white, a white bridge. Hmm. That's so weird. What is her name? I'll be looking out for her, perhaps. Althea. Althea. Hmm. I'll she looks few... like this. Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'll keep an eye out for her. What the hell is that? It means I don't remember what well, she looked like. <laughs> I mean, I guess have fun on the rest of your honeymoon. Thank you. You're welcome. All right. I'll hang around and wait and see which direction you're all going in. Okay. I think we're going down the tunnel. I think we're going to go down the tunnel, but I'd like to go kill that guy first. I'd like to know if we go down the tunnel. The guy in the bar. Where are we going? I think either way, if we go up or down, we're going to be wanted. Doctor. Hmm. You said you came here to destroy this network. Yes, I picked up their scent and wish to know more. So perhaps you could perhaps guide us as to once we leave the tunnels, do you know of any places where we can be safe for the night? Well, I do have a couple of contacts. In this district, your best place is a little dive bar called the Howling Hound. Oh boy, better write it down. Howling Hound. Howling. That's redundant. That is not where I am staying. <laughs> but it is a safe place. Think no, um, think the lower deck in Titanic. Ah. Not a, not a dangerous place, but you know, rowdy in a Easy. good way. Rowdy Easy. in a good uh, way. Two Penny District, or the hold on, what is it? Called? That is in the Ten Penny Slums. Yes. Ten Penny Slums. The Ten Penny. <laughs> two Penny District and the Ten Penny Slums. Yay. I was very close. You didn't know either one of those. I wasn't here. You're correct. I'm sorry. That is in the slums. The place that's in this district is called the Pegasus Earth. That's where he's saying. Got it. I want to... This is what I want to do. I want to walk upstairs, go to that guard, and be like, oh, hey, listen, somebody fainted downstairs. Can you go downstairs for just a second? And then when he walks downstairs, <laughs> kill him, and then, then we can move on. I feel really bad leaving somebody who knows all of our faces. The whole bar knows all of our faces. Was there a lot of people in the bar? It was yeah. about two-thirds full. Yeah, oh. Plus a bartender and the guy Can who took go up and just my burn the whole thing yeah. down? That's what I said. And you're like, no, 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 we can't burn it down. It was a scene. I think burning it down is a good opportunity right now. Okay. Only because the people upstairs can run out and be safe. And the people downstairs got trapped in the fire and died in a smoldering death. Not murdered. Oopsie poopsie, gas leak. No? Alright, fine. Everyone's I'm all okay in with mark of death on top of them. I'm I not am I fine with burn the fucker down. Who can burn it down? I can burn it down. She can burn it down. She can burn it down. Burn the fucker down. <laughs> <laughs> well, we need to get out of here. So, let's go through the tunnels. Laurel, I do what I you got to do. Fire okay, the Beginning. question is, do you go upstairs and light the fire in the bar, or do you just burn this bottom basement area down? The is there alcohol let the smoke liquor? go upstairs? Yes, there is. And... Guys, there's liquor here. We toss it all over everything. Mm-hmm. I set firebolt. It goes up. Whoop! Yeah. And we're in the tunnel. And we're in the tunnel. And we're in the tunnels. Okay. Yeah. We're in the tunnels with no exit. 
There's got to be an exit. Oh, no, no. From the ledger, we think it's the house, but we don't know what awaits us at the, at the house. We still have some time. Okay. I'll go for a quick jaunt. Anybody want to come with me? I'll go with you. I'm busy okay. painting. All right. I'm going to go fast. I know you can keep up with me. Come yes. on, let's go. And yes, Kara's not 77. I know. <laughs> Come on, let's take a quick jump. Carrot can't keep up with you speed wise, right. but endurance. Endurance, no exactly. No problem. Like, even Spot has to just. At the end, and Carrot's just like, we done. We want to keep going. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> All right, so come on, let's go. And we're going to go down to the basement and walk until we see a light at the end of the tunnel. Okay. It takes about 45 minutes to get to the end of the tunnel. I'm sure the place is doused in alcohol by now. In those 45 minutes, what is happening in the, 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 the place? Dousing in alcohol. Yeah, I guess we're just getting it ready to go up. And, um, I mean, we've ransacked everything, right? Like, we've yes. taken anybody's money or we've gone through everything. So, yeah. So then we just, we just set it to burn. I'm also going to go over to the buffet and eat a little bit. Well, I think, I think I might cut off certain appendages. I'm just saying. Before you set the flame, allow me to exit with these fine young ladies. One moment, please. And he, he does an incantation, and the four girls all look like elven men. Oh. <laughs> They're disguised. We should have done this on the way in! Anyway, <laughs> I bid you all a fine farewell, and good journeys. Maybe our paths will cross again sometime. I like him. He was nice. Mm. Girls, do what I do, say what I say. We'll be fine. Give us about 90 seconds before you light the fire. Got it. All right. And they take their leave. They exit. Very cool. Very cool. What do we see at the end of the tunnel? When you get to the end of the tunnel, you're in this wide open chamber. And on the right hand side, um, there's a split in the ground. And you could tell this chamber looks like it was once some kind of grand ballroom to a large house that got damaged by some sort of earthquake. Because there's now a shift in the ground where like uh, an escarpment happens, where there's like a, a dip or a rift that has cut straight through the center of this chamber. That looks like it was once an old uh, ballroom. You're on slightly to the left half left from coming out of the tunnel of the ballroom. The rift is on the right and then the rest of the ballroom is on the right hand side. Do I hear or see anything? Make a perception check. Not 20, 27. Okay. You creep a little further in. Uh, there's sort of this weird almost like natural when the rocks split, like way that bridges across the escarpment. Uh, it looks a little tentative, but you might be able to cross it. There's also... Uh, immediately on your left hand side you see a set of stone stairs going down and across the way across the rift on the right hand side toward the end of the chamber you see there's an open like storage area there also appears to be a hallway across the rift to the right hand side do I hear anything? can't quite hear anything at the moment I don't want to go investigating without them what do you think Gary? what bothers me oh, is if they start the fire and we still haven't gotten to anything here. I th this is my dilemma. That, and we don't know what's beyond those places. What if we burn this place down and there's people there? It took you 45 minutes to get to this point. It's already burning. Oh, no. We didn't, oh, no. I, we're just they were waiting for us. They're oh, you're waiting? Up. Oh, never mind. Don't mind me. Yeah. All right. Well, if we're been gone for 45 minutes anyway. Let's do a little bit more investigating. I will sneak and stealth over to that pantry area. Okay, you're going to have to cross the rift to do that. How thick is it? Uh, it's maybe about 10 feet diagonally. Does it look well trafficked? Uh, make an investigation check. Or survival. All out survival. Well, either way, it's a negative one, man. Survival should be wisdom. Oh, survival? Yeah, that's better. Survival. Dirty 20. Yeah, it does look like it's fairly well trafficked. You're seeing several sets of tracks going back and forth. All right, I'm going to bring the kick out. It looks like people cross this on a regular basis. Uh, the staircase going the other way, same thing? Well trafficked? Yep. There are people who come and go. I bet you there's more girls here. They said this was a stash house. There's going to be people here. What do you think we should do? I, I'm at a loss. People saw us come in. I want to burn the bodies because people saw us come in. This is our only way out. We've got to go this way. 
we can't walk out into that bar and walk away with all those bodies down there. I would say if it took 45 minutes to, for them to get here, maybe we camp in the hallway until we're about arrested, but we gotta take down this house. Or maybe we can sneak out before anyone notices. I don't even know. All right, let's go back. Yeah. And we'll tell them exactly what we found. Okay. And let's all, we'll all make the decision. Yeah, I like it. All right, so we'll <laughs> take 45 minutes to walk back. <clears throat> blah, 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 blah. I still say it's the best plan of action. Light this up and walk down the tunnel. Does we like to get like... anybody else's opinion or is everybody wants to do it? Yeah, I think that's fine. Okay. Tunnel? I'm fine with it. Yep. Okay. Okay, so tunnel to the to the open mansion. Mm-hmm. Okay. 45 minutes, 45 minutes back, and now another 45 minutes through. So that's an hour and a half. So now we're over two hours. Plus a sh- two and a half hours, plus there was a short rest in there. Three and a half hours. About an hour, mm, two hours maneuvering through the city. Five and a half. It's around dinner time at this point. Just for keeping the time of day consistent. It would be around 5, 6 p.m. What's up? We've had a long day. You've had a very long day. Okay, and now you all, one by one, arrive at this open chamber. Here's a question. As we're walking in that 45 minutes with the whole group, do we want to just take a rest here in the hallway and see if we can just chill in the hallway? Or do we think we're going to be discovered? I think that there is a fire potentially engulfing the building at the other end of this. Anybody who works there, who knows this tunnel is there, that this is how he brought in the girls, you know what I mean? Like, they're probably going to rally at this manor house that we're coming out at, right? Oh, yeah. Great idea. Okay. I mean, where would you go? (laughs) You're right. Let's go fight in the mansion. So so no resting inside the tunnel. You're going into the big chamber. Big chamber. Okay. Big ballroom. Here we go. We're going to go rest in the chamber. Let's go. Okay, big ballroom, a uh, rift that cuts diagonally through it. Oh, no, a rift that cuts basically, cuts it like in two-thirds. Yeah. Two-thirds on, if you're coming out of the terminal, two-thirds of it's on your left. A third of it is on your right, with uh, that sort of natural stone path that goes diagonally across the rift. You see a large star- storage room straight ahead over the rift to the right, a set of stairs that goes down to the left, and across the rift, to the directly to the right, you see some kind of hallway. We gotta investigate. Okay, what are you investigating? I am going to go in here, over toward the staircase, and I'm gonna listen to at the staircase. You listen at that staircase. I'm gonna be doing it stealthily, please. You hear me? I heard you. Make a stealth check. Hurt. I'm getting excited now. Natural one? No. <laughs> Twelve. Okay. You think you're being stealthy? Perception? To quote a good friend of mine. <laughs> one and a... Natural one? Natural one. Two. 23. 23 perception. Okay. At the uh, the the stairway, right? At the stairway. All right. Two heaven. All right. You hear at the bottom of the stairs, there's a wooden door mm-hmm. on the left-hand side, and then there's a hallway that goes to the right. You hear immediately on the left-hand side coming out of the door, you hear like like sounds of a card game almost going on. And you hear voices just like, oh, no, go on, up your sleeves, go on now, hands on the table. Like, and you hear cards being dealt, you hear coins, a little bit of smell of smoke. How many voices? Um, more than one, less than a hundred? Do I see anybody? No, the door's closed. Oh, but I hear the sound of a bunch of guys yeah. on playing cards. Now, from the tunnel, I'm not the tunnel, from the hallway, you hear several different sounds. You hear clanking, like keys Mm -hmm. clanking together. Footsteps, like rhythmic. And um, if you listen for a second, you hear the sound of like a quick bang, like metal on metal. And you hear, stop your crying. Okay. Back up. Share this information. I don't think it's the place we should go first. I think we should go investigate the rest. I listen, listen. We will take care of it, right? We will take care of it. It is very, very temporary. But I think we need to know what's going on with the rest of the house before we go down there. Just give me a few moments, please. 
It's okay. We'll bathe the walls with their blood. Yes. I'm very excited. I'm going to practice my drawing. Okay. I'm going to go to the other hallway. Stealth again? The other hallway. Didn't you say across the ball? You have to go across the, the rift. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah okay. Yeah. Okay. Cross so the yeah, rift. that'll require. An, I'll, you, I, you got across the rift once, but it'll require a stealth check if you want to go stealthily. Yes, please. Stealth. Okay. Seventeen. Okay. You think you're being stealthy? <clears throat> okay. Perception. Another one. Okay. The hallway goes in, turns right, turns left. Goes down about 20 feet, ends at a blank wall. That's the whole chamber? Yep. At the blank wall, I want to do an investigation said, check. Okay. Make uh, make an investigation check. Uh, 17. 17. A pocket wall opens up. <laughs> oh, what's the smell? Immediately, it's just like stale, musty kind of a smell, and... You open up into uh, effectively a beer storage. Like there's barrels of ale all around. Anyone around me? No, there's no there's no people in this chamber. It's just it's just a large, like forty by forty chamber with just barrels everywhere that you can see. There is a door that looks like it comes in from the outside. Um, that might be another entrance if you were entering from outside the the, the manor and not this yeah, yeah. secret tunnel. It yeah. looks like there, there's another door that looks like it comes in from the outside. That will be able to escape. Yeah. Okay. Click, click. Close it again. Okay. All right. And now, if I'm not mistaken, there's the rift is here, staircase going down, and us. And then there's the rift, and then there was this hallway that I went down, and then there's also another storage there, right? Yeah. Okay. So, what's in the storage? Uh, that storage room, this looks like a general, almost like work area. There's like various tools, uh, light hammers, uh, chisels, um... No people. Pieces of scrap metal, there's no people in this chamber. There also appears to be no other way out of it that you can see. At a okay. quick at a quick glance, you look, there doesn't appear to be another way out. Okay. I'm gonna go back over the rift. Okay. This is what I found, blah, 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 blah. My idea is we go downstairs, we destroy the one inept guard, take the girls, and try to sneak them past that poker game. How about I disguise myself as, what was his name, Melvin? Melvin? The doctor took the girls. Yeah. I was there's say, which girls girl? in the prison Oh, yes. Okay. I was going to say, there's Never more right. girls down there. Yeah, yeah, That's yeah. Right. yeah. There's more girls You're down right. there. Sorry. So you want to be Melvin and walk down and be like, I need those girls up yes. here? I like it. Yeah. All right. At least we release the rest of them. I did my job. Destroy. Melvin. Okay, and you're just walking down? Yeah. Okay, you go in, you go down the stairs. Door or hallway and other door? Card game or metal clanking, stop your crying? I would say card game. Okay. Oh, no, hold on a second. Oh, hi, boss. And you see... um, a more rugged-looking human male. These, there's four in this room right now. Four, three humans, one elf. They all look a little bit beefier than the ones you fought back in the uh, in the do. Baron's Lover. They look more strength-based, mm-hmm. whereas the other ones you fought were like sneaky, rapier. These are like longsword battle axe guys. Oh, okay. Hey, boss. What's um, up? I have to do my best Melvin impression, don't I? Yes, you do. Performance. With advantage, because you look like him. <laughs> You've been sucking, so we're not going to use you. Mask of many faces. Fucking love that feat so much. 22. Okay. Whoever's listening, she fools you. That's how much she sounds like smooth hands when she's talking. You're like, holy shit. Is this what I pay you for? Well, b- boss, it wasn't our turn in the rotation. Ugh. The little downtime amongst the boys. Listen, these commodities, I need them all now. Oh. Uh, big party. Big party? Yes. I all need right. them all. All right, all right, no problem. Sorry. Guys, uh, come on, uh, cheese it. Look alive, look alive. All right, no, no. Also, I, I, yeah, just get them. <laughs> uh, the four of them all, like, jump to it and just... One stamps out like what looks to be some sort of crudely hand rolled cigarette. Right away, boss. Right away, boss. And I'm walking by you, clipping long sword, you know, sheathing long swords. Mm-hmm. 
<laughs> Boss is here. We gotta take the we gotta take the merchandise. Another one opens up, and uh, a guard who doesn't appear to be he's in armor, but he doesn't appear to be holding any weapons, just opens the door. But it's early. Oh shit! Sorry, boss. Whatever you want. Turns and there is a the chamber is about thirty by thirty. Mm -hmm. 20 by 20 of it is a cage, is a large, like, prison cell, almost. Mm -hmm. And there's about 10 women <laughs> in it right now. Mm -hmm. Make a perception check, Lorelai. There's 10 what? 10 women. Uh, that's pretty shitty. Uh, 10. 10? Mm -hmm. That's enough. Okay. I'll remember that. We'll deal with that in a second. Uh, should we take them over to the cistern, boss? Some of them are a little dirty. No. The, the company that I have here they like them rugged oh <laughs> they're smelly. in town again it's smelly and dirty <laughs> i'm smelly oh, and dirty and you like me <laughs> hey to each their own what can i say the investors are actually here to take them all right come on girls look alive look alive and one of the ones from the card game is like sm smacking them on the butt with his long sword as they go by there's no need I don't want them bruised before the investors get them. All right, boss, whatever. She has a sword. And um, you notice one of them uh, stands out a little bit. She's probably the oldest amongst the ten. And she stands out because she's got this long, silky blonde hair mm -hmm. and these brilliant green eyes. Do I know her? Oh, fuck. You got your phone right. Oh, no. Are we going to get emotional oh. in this bitch? Oh. Mm hmm Okay. Throw the red flag anytime you want. No. Okay. No. Okay. And they just file back down that hallway, up the stairs, and uh, they're about to turn to go down the tunnel. Got it. When they run into all of you, mm -hmm. one draws the, his longsword oh. immediately. Is Boss, no, intruders! There's no need. I told you I had investors. These are the investors. Are you going to turn away their gold? Do you have that kind of power? Do you have that kind of gold? Do I pay you to think? Make a deception check with advantage. <laughs> 18. Okay, you basically couldn't fail. I was just trying to get you to roll another one so I could. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. I'm just trying to invent reasons to make you roll. Like, that was impossible to fail. There was no way you were failing that. But, uh, <laughs> just trying to make you roll. Um... All right, boss, if I may say so, you're dealing with some weird fucking people now. Yes, I hired you for the first weird thing I dealt with. All right, we taking them to the barons? N no, the investors are going to take them and I'm going to follow them. All right. Um, don't question me. What should we do in the meantime, boss? I don't know. Go stick your thumb up your ass or whatever you were doing before I came down here. All right, let's go. Boss is in a weird fucking mood tonight. That's I nice. wait for them to go back to the hole in which they have come out of. They disappear and you hear the doors close and Okay. So um, we want to get these so if there's no guards around, we want to get these girls through the brewery, right? Mm -hmm. That you set fire to? No. No, the brewery. Oh you mean out the other way. Yeah, I'm sorry. Way. <laughs> At least you wanna just stick them in there and then we can go and take care of these fuckers. Are we saying this in front of the girls? I'll whisper it to you. Okay. I'm stage I'm, whispering. Thank I, you. I'm going to stage. I'm going to stage whisper to you that I'm going to stay disguised for right now. <clears throat> okay. So the girls listen and don't panic. Okay. okay. So then let's walk them over, look the, over the crack, mm -hmm. and into the brewery. Yes. Okay. And somebody should say, "Hey, just stay here." I don't know if we should I'll be say it. it. Okay. It takes you a few minutes to go gingerly. Across that rift, mm -hmm. over down that hallway, opens up the pocket door, and you can tell that when Spot opens the pocket door, the the ten women they they're very confused at this point. They don't know what's going on. Mm -hmm. So what happens now? As you went, to, you all, you stay here. You know who we are, and we know you know what we can do. You stay right here. Do you understand? Yes, sir. Go. And they all go into that room. Okay. And you're just leaving them there? I'm half tempted mm. to say you go away and I'll be like, run, 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 run. And then close the door. <laughs> uh, no. Uh, how are they getting out of here? We have no way for them to exit right now. 
I turn to the the one that looks older with the blonde hair and the green eyes. Yes. You especially. You keep them all here. We have your daughter. And if they are escape or you escape, we kill her. No one leaves this room. Good. Shut the door. Time to go kill things. That's a great breaking point. <laughs> <laughs>